Hello everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That. We're the inspirational channel that goes behind the scenes, interviews some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. So we're back with a Tech Tuesday, and today we're gonna be talking about OBS. Within OBS, we've had several questions about you know the recordings and some of the other issues. So we're gonna put these in probably different segments in different videos because we wanna really reflect on the question that's asked. So make sure you do like and subscribe so that way you get notifications to you know up and coming videos and put in the comments anything that you you know may have holdups on or questions on. What we'll do is we'll put those into future segments and try to answer all those questions that we can and get them out there as quick as we can. But usually we found that the videos help the best instead of um, you know trying to put a reply in there and trying to give you all that information through the reply because it just seems to, to hold up things and gets, gets a little confusing. But the question that we had in regards to OBS is of course the black screen issue that we had uh, you know put the video out there and you guys had some questions about some of the applications that are you know not running. So this will be one video, as I said, there's gonna be a few other ones up and coming. So watch those, we'll try to put them out in a sequence. So this one's gonna be the first one and it's gonna talk about some of the apps that are out there. And of course, you see behind me is Netflix. So what we always recommend, especially with a lot of the apps, this is one fix. Don't use the app, don't download the app on your desktop and we always recommend using a desktop especially if you're using obs and recording it works so much better or you know your laptop's about the same but don't use ipad don't use iphone it, they just um or any other you know recording device we found that the the desktop actually works the best then your laptop will work as well uh, but don't use the app the app has so many different security features within it, embedded in it, uh, that it blocks you. So that's one of the issues there. Um, and we talked about security settings. I tried to answer some of those questions, but just avoid from the app. That's, that's the first big step. Next thing, and you ask, well, if I avoid from the app, well, how am I supposed to watch my Netflix? Just log into it on your computer directly. It's not like a phone where a lot of times the phone automatically redirects you to that app and forces you to use that app pretty much. Um, the desktop does not. You can still go on to the, the website directly, just log it into whatever provider that you're using and then go on to that, uh, that site and log in and then it should record. Now, of course, as we talked on the black screen issue, it all depends to what, you know, there might be settings if you're using uh, Google Chrome or if you're using uh, Internet Explorer or, or if you're using Firefox, as we, we mentioned that that's the best to always use because the security features are within uh, your, your search provider too. So there are security features in there. Now on Google Chrome, um, you can also take out the security features, but getting back to this, we don't, the next video we'll talk about that, but utilize that, uh, utilize their website directly. And then if there's some issues with that, you can go into the security settings. It should record. Uh, but if it doesn't, you can always shut off those security settings that are in there. There's not as many security settings, um, or blocking. Uh, issues within the direct link. So we hope this helps, you know, answer that question. And then the next one, well, like I said, we'll be putting out more uh, in regards to some other applications that uh, you guys had had questions uh, in regards to that. Uh, but we hope this uh, video helps in regards to that. Any other questions, put in the comments and we'll try to put out future videos. So we'll see you on the next one.